Hey guys, Stingamer here, and welcome back to SPDFR. Today we're, today we're patrolling the, this area of Blaine County in British Gamer 88X5. It's the marked version, as you can see. It's a very nice car. We'll actually just clean it right now because it's a bit dirty. There we go. I think up the hazards. Now, I'm just going to be patrolling around this area and maybe take some colours, cause it a little bit out. So I'm just pull in here and see that I'm available for call outs. And let's come with the patrol. So I've got a white dot on the minimap there, so I think it's this car over here. I don't know what's wrong with it, so we're just gonna take a look into it. I'm not sure what's actually wrong with it. Oh yeah, it's it's dead. As you can see, maybe through the windows, it's kind of busted up. So let's just try and get it before it goes on to this intersection bit here. Now it doesn't work for me because it's kind of stopping the flow of traffic. So let's try and get it in to the side of the road. There we go. So it is a saddler. So dispatch can get a plate check on a saddler. Best it's a car, it's a very nice. I have got a unmarked version of this car, which has been by Double Doctor. I must have used that, but I'm going to use that later. So we've got, so we've got three citations, it is insured, and the owner is John Sully. Let's just go talk to it, to this guy. Yeah, there's, there's a bit of oh, uh, let's go out. Freeze, freeze. Hug. That was a bit weird, it was not like me. Get him. Come on, come here. Taser. Just have to taser him. Freeze, please. On the ground now. On the ground. I don't know why he ran then. Well, I was going to put him into custody. You're being, you're being under arrest for, for running from police. Just come with me. And we'll put him Crazy. in the back of our car. And of course, his vehicle has despawned. So I can't even look at it. So I'm going to call prisoner transport for evading police. For a suspect placed under arrest in Sandy Shores. Copy that, dispatch. Roger. Sit, sit down, boy. Sit down. Sit your ass down. I'm going to call you out. Right, we'll just wait for the transport, which is going to be another X5. Which is floating. I, I keep getting that for some reason. When they're far away, it's like the floating bit. Oh well. Hey! Sup? Right, let's get back to our unit and come up to all. Let's run. Run. <laughs> run back with eager. Don't miss that. Right. That's how things work. The criminals can open the doors. In DC Explosion, we'll take that and we'll turn around here. What is that card? I don't know what that's doing. What the hell is it? The film got the sounds on it, so try that. Right, so we've got an In DC Explosion call. I'm just going to go to it. I think it might be that guy, yep. I think you can see him over there. It looks like he's standing in the, in the road. Not sure what he's doing, looks a bit drunk actually from what I can see now. Dispatch him on scene. We've got it's occupied times one. Looks like a male. I am um, going up to suspect now. Seems to be walking away from me here. Just trying to catch him. Excuse me, sir. Sir. Excuse me. Oh yeah, so it looks like he's got, my friend's got me drunk and did this to me, so he's we wearing pants. Um, I will offer him a ride home. This is going to take this guy home. He looks a bit drunk, I don't think he'll do this on his own. Is he following me? I don't know. Maybe you get in the car, buddy. You know, I'm giving you a ride home. Oh, 
So this is what I like about this like you can either put them like you got like a two different choices. You can either put them under arrest or take him home. I'm gonna take this guy home because I'm a nice guy. But obviously, if I see someone him doing it again, he will be placed under arrest because I've given him the benefit of the doubt this time. If I see it again, he is going to be detained and put in a cell until someone can either we let him go and give him a citation, or he or he, get, or he makes bail. One or two. Wait a minute, where's his house? Oh, kill me. It's, I'm not, I can't do that. I'm just going to say that I handed him off to someone else because I can't take it all the way down there. Right, like we have a terrorist attack. So all units respond in. Code 99 emergency. Target is armed with explosives. Use of deadly force permitted. So we have got some terrorists in the local local squad, squad team to assist us because it is a local terrorist, uh, uh, well, terrorist call and we are responding to access all units. I think it's in Mount Chiliad, but we'll make the trip to it. Have terrorists walking around with bombs. It's that explosive, sir. We're probably just packing. <gasps> Jesus, we're probably packing some firepower as well. We'll just have explosives and try to start a fight with police. So we've probably got some guns as well, I would expect. So we have to be careful here. Now we have we are supposed to choose our right weapons here. So I've got a pistol ready. So it's not gonna be a taser. It's gonna be literally just shoot. Because it is one of calls. Well, let me feel. Let me feel. We're almost at the point where they are, and I can't see anything so far. Wait, I think I can see something. I got to the oh god, there they are. He's on scene, he's on scene. Not chilly on. All units respond code 99. Proceed with caution. Use of deadly force permitted. No, don't do that. God damn it. It's because I've got my easy controller. One's down, one's down. The reason I like this is because I've got somebody. Please have to sit there. Oh, officer down. Officer is down. Officer down. The reason I wear them, please, Alf, is because I've got, um,. The people that are using this call out are the um, like mercenary guys. And I've got police officers set, um, like set for that slot. So where is my car? It's here. So I'm just gonna this. We're gonna pretend that we have magical powers and teleport. I think we've actually been dealt with. Yeah, so we're in that trip for to kill one guy and get shot in basically the back of the head. But I think some, I think they got that cleared. So we can be code four off of this. And I'll see you and I'll see you guys back at our normal patrol area. So it's got a call about um, homeless people. I think it is a tram that's probably causing a disturbance. So we're going to go to where his location is and see what the problem is. That could be anything from him just making loud noises to threatening or even just being a nuisance. Like it could be anything like he's trying to break into the property and make shelter. Um, he could be shouting loudly or anything. But we'll see. We'll go and see what's happening. And if it can't be resolved in a slap on the wrist and him leaving, he will be taken to the local jail, and we'll see what happens from there. So it is, yeah, so they are in the middle of the road, and this can be a problem. So just gonna park up here. So it's the is. Oh, he's got, he has got a broken bottle, and be careful here. I'm just gonna turn the car on him this way so, we, so I can get out in time. Right, taser out, taser. Freeze, freeze, taser, taser, taser! On the ground, on the ground! Drop the bottle, on the ground now, on the ground! 
on the ground. One in custody. Right, let's get right. So let's, let's, get, let's get into the car. Excuse yourself right now. Get into the car. Oh, fuck me sideways. Calm right. down. Get in the get car. I'll just piss off you stupid. Yep, great role play because he's just pissing me off. Right, so we have got one in custody. We're going to take him to the local jail. He'll come up with a knife. That could have been dangerous actually because if he would have actually stabbed me, he could have done lots of worse things because I haven't got a ballistic vest on. It's just this is actually like normal cotton, I think. But you never know, I didn't know what was actually happening here and he did come up with a broken glass bottle, I thought it was just like making a lot of noise, but at least he's off the streets now and he will be taken to jail for attempted attempted assault on a police officer and um, just being a nuisance because he came at me with a knife, that is never a good thing. So I have done a change like in my last couple of SPDFR videos except for the newest one they were like American style but I got a bit bored of doing American because like, I'm not really like related to it or anything so I'll come back to the Met because the reason I went to American like kind of vehicles because there wasn't many Met vehicles on this game and now there's, now there's more like being made I can kind of make a better role play so we'll take them to the cell ourselves And see, see look, these improvements are amazing. Because like, in my last patrols in the city, I'm actually walking to the cell, but now it's teleport to it. And can I get into this one when I teleported? No, I can't. Look. Do you want me to beat your asshole? I have a bloody baton. I will beat you. Please, brutality. Right, so step into the cell. Right, Leon, you'll be placed under arrest for attempted assault on a, a police officer. You'll be, yes, yeah, yes, no one cares. You'll be kept here for one to two days. Then you'll be put on trial in a local court. You'll either be fined or you'll be found guilty and sent to the local jail or just the jail. So I'll see you in court. Yep. Oh, shut up, Tim. No one cares. So we're getting close to the end of our patrol this well today. What's happening here? You don't have to tell me. Let's go check this out. It's just two guys, like, standing in the middle of the road. Let's turn the lights on. Sirs, sir. What's going on here? Damn. Right, I'm gonna see if I can make him leave. Sir, I'm gonna have to, have to ask you to Come leave. Up, if you will, let's see if he'll leave. Here's some advice. Never run away from the police. Right, okay, we're not gonna not he's not looking like he's gonna leave. So I'm gonna issue a citation to him. Because there's something there's something in the middle of the road. I'm gonna talk to his buddy over there. In a second, like they'll, they'll stop in traffic if I'm coming through this bit. Um, I'm stuck. Next time a cop wants you, don't run away. Well, okay, I think his buddy's. I can't really dismiss his buddy because it's like he's not gonna move. So we're just gonna leave him there. Alright, so I thought they get hit. So let's just move on along. Citizens report a suspect I won't get through the go street races because we end up in long ass chases that are just so annoying. Okay, let's just go to this. 
course, doing this refusing to pay. Wait a minute, the internet's all in LS. Yeah, look, most of these are in LS, so we're just going to have to ignore it. Because it's in LS, like, I don't know why, like, we're not, they haven't really gone to some of the shores yet. So when they're refusing to pay, that's normally in LS. It's not used to the call outs, like, where they will be. Yeah, look, look at that engine. Look again. There's another one where his engine's busted. Let's go see if this guy will run. We'll be in the last part of our patrol today because it's getting close to the time when our ship is over. Yeah, look at that. You see, the front of his wheels just melted off. Right, um, this way, going to get a plate check on a Rebel 2. Six, seven, Charles, Ocean, David, and two, four, seven. Proceed with caution. Right, it's a proceed with caution. So it's going to walk up here. It's going to run. It seems to be annoyed. Hello, my Hello. I'm Officer Wright with the Metro Pod Police. Um, I stopped you here because your vehicle is a bit damaged. Can I give you your ID, please? So we've got a Catlin Woods. Okay, just hold on tight. We'll go check the police database. Oh, no, damn it. Cat. Lynn. Woods. Let's have that in right. I think typed it in wrong. Cat. Lynn. Woods. If it's wrong, then I'm going to check the police data. I'm going to check it again. Yep, let's take a screenshot by accident. Right, let's get the brief. How do you spell it? Right, let's see if what comes back. So, we'll actually see the spy, yeah. So, I think we're going to now. She's probably going to try and evade police. But if not, we'll take her out of her vehicle. Right, Caitlin, you um, I found that your license is expired, so I'm going to ask you to leave your vehicle, please. Are you being put under arrest for not having a valid license? If you can actually, um, um, make make the arrest. Oh my God, that's why you use control because when you press B, that happens. So I guess we're just going to call this is actually tried to attack me and I rested her and now everything's okay. Still want to hit me over here. So if you didn't enjoy this patrol, it is a bit of a sham patrol and I'm gonna try and do better next time because things have gone wrong like that instance over there. But if you didn't enjoy it please leave a like, comment and subscribe and I've been Sony Gaming. This has been the Met Project and Please patrols and I'll see you guys next time. Goodbye!